Well, what's going on everyone? Another Beaver update. I'm not even sure what Beaver update this is. I lost track on how many times I updated y'all on the Beaver issue back here in the park and in my backyard. So, uh, you know, haven't seen the Beavers built in the last uh, two or a half weeks. So I was like, oh, well, what's going on with these guys? How come they haven't been building? Well, over the night, Sunday night, they built. So I want to show you all the dam. Now, uh, I'm not going to get any closer to it because, uh, you know, I'll get a little close, but not too close. The federal guy did come out uh, Monday, uh, whatever today's date is. Uh, I'll put it down in the description box. Um, but the uh, the federal guy came out. Uh, he's the one who was going to trap the beavers and get rid of them and stuff like that. And he came out with two larger traps. Uh, since the last beaver was like 85 pounds, he had to go back and get some bigger traps uh, for the uh, for these beavers. So let me show you all the dam, all right? So, so there it is. Like I said, I'm gonna stop right here because uh, the federal guy said he put out a trap somewhere here. I don't know where exactly it is, but he put something out. Look at them. Little juckers, I'll tell you what. But I, it's, it's amazing. They blocked it up, but not too too well. It's still flowing. But my little underwater pipe system is working. I do have uh, three pipes. One right there where you see that little uh, metal pole right there. There's one of them right there. I got another one um, just right up there. And then I got this long one that goes out in the middle uh, on a T. So that way they can't really shove anything inside to block up the tube or whatever. But I got that in there. And then of course I got the large, larger one. This is a six inch one I put out there. As you can see, it is taking water. Uh, so that's good. There's some flowing going on there. But uh, I'm not gonna get any closer because I can't really tell where that trap at. But look, let's stop. Like, look, it's a piece of a root system from a tree there. All kinds of sticks, mud, grass. Uh, looking over there, looks like the instructor started bringing in some bigger logs because that was not there the other day. Now, that could have been from that one storm we had over the weekend. We did have a crazy wind storm that could have broke it down. But uh, you guys can see, I don't see any large tree arms hanging over. So evidently, those little suckers run that up because you can look at the teeth marks right there where they've been biting at and tearing it down. So they brought it in. Uh, yeah. So they are causing a little bit more flooding issue here. And uh, down here, got a trail of water running through. That part is dry. That's because they blocked it up. So it's dry over there ish but uh yeah crazy crazy at least we got some water flowing at least on what my traps or my my little uh <laughs> what's the word i'm looking for my little uh water flow idea is working so that's good but yeah so there you go my friends beaver update number whatever I <laughs> like I said I totally forgot uh, what update this is I've done a lot uh, a lot of people have been asking me about the beavers every time I get onto the uh, on the live feeds and stuff like that I've been doing on uh, like Tuesday Wednesday Thursday stuff like Saturday people have been asking me about beaver update on the on the park and uh, here in the backyard so try to give you a beaver update there so uh, yeah it's a nightmare these little juckers can't ever stop them or outsmart them i always say that you can never outsmart these things these are smart beavers <laughs> i have tried everything in my power to stop them but they just keep building away gotta give it to these little juckers they can build they build good i want to show you something my neighbor put up There's a sign that says LA beavers are smarter. 
Now, LA is not Los Angeles. It actually stands for Leland area where I live at, Leland, North Carolina, right off the coast and stuff. About 10 minutes from Wilmington, North Carolina. So if you know where Wilmington is, you know where I'm at. But LA beavers are smarter. <laughs> I never thought that was funny to put that up. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But there you go, my friends. Oof, bright sun. It's crazy. Over the weekend, it was windy, rainy, crazy. Couldn't get out and do anything. Now today is beautiful, gorgeous. But uh, yeah, there you go, my friends. Beaver update on the channel. All right. That's it. I'll uh, give y'all another update, let you know if he caught one. I think he'll probably be out, maybe he might be out the next day after or so, maybe. We'll see. But anyway, all right, I will see y'all in another video. Might be at a beaver update, might be an RC video. Who knows? My hair looks funky. <laughs> all right, y'all, later.